Hello viewers, I am Dr. Rahul Reddy from Androcare Androids Institute Hyderabad. In this video, we will be discussing about uh, how to improve your sperm motility. Normally, when you see your semen analysis report, if motility is less, uh, the diagnosis is written as asthenospermia. Asthenospermia means low motility. Now, what are the probable causes for this low motility and how to treat this uh, particular issue? So now see, if you see uh, the testicular uh, sperm production happens inside the testis, but most of the sperms inside the testis are generally non-motile, they do not move. Only when the sperm it passes through a part, sperm first part of the sperm tube which is called epididymis, then only the sperm gets motility. So any infection in this part, uh, the first cause is any defective sperm production inside the testis or genetic cause uh, where there is defective production which leads to defective production that is the first cause. Second cause is any infection or disturbance in the epididymis can lead to uh, low sperm motility and third one any infection in the prostate gland or semen reservoir can also lead to low sperm motility because the uh, since there is infection the as long the, uh, the more the duration sperm lies in this reservoir and more the sperm gets damaged. And fourth cause is any heat increase in testicular temperature either because of tight undergarments or tight underways or working in heat environments or some problems like varicocele where there is excessive heat in the testis can lead to low sperm motility. So now how to treat them is if there is infection we have to take an antibiotic your doctor try to identify what kind of infection you have these infections can be bacterial, they can be fungal, they can be sexually transmitted, sometimes even viral infections can cause infection. So your doctor will identify what kind of infection it is, they will give medications for your infection and second set of medications what they prescribe is antioxidants. Antioxidants are micronutrients, sometimes we call them as mitochondrial medicine. These medications are like coenzyme Q10. Uh, astaxanthin, lycopene, l arginine zinc, these are micronutrients which are necessary for sperm production and sperm motility. When you take these medications, they help in the sperm formation and in turn improves their sperm motility. Now, apart from these two things, if there is excessive heat because of any other your lifestyle problem, you have to uh, decrease the testicular temperature. You have to avoid uh, smoking and alcohol, any type of tobacco intake, even tobacco chewing or tobacco smoking is not good for sperm. And third one, if there is varicocele, severe uh, grade varicocele, better to get it operated. Otherwise, these medications may not help in improving your sperm motility. So, okay viewers, I think we discussed about uh, asthenospermia. If you have any other doubts regarding this topic or any other men's health topic, please write in comment section. We will try to make a uh, video on that. Please subscribe to our channel and thanks for viewing.